compared to like going to nasty or lacquer jake like yes it's nice to have but like if you're not running precision primary that sounds really bad to go second because then you're either gonna lack some you either lack bonus damage or you're lacking tenacity which could help you get more like damage off in team fights last stand damage is not much to where like it's gonna be worth the take it's kind of bad grass pot exists people will run it but it's not actually like that strong it's only just there for you like as like i guess a quote-unquote safety net in lane if you're like very scared of the laner and you're like a, you want to like try to sustain yourself but like even then it's like you're not getting that much sustain out of the actual ruins it just counter acts it's, it's like counterproductive in my opinion but i i've talked to like soul and other like high low clubs about it and they all have like the same opinion on it even with the tank build like it, it, this is no reason to ever go with, like tank or go grasp all those things there's just way better options you can go if you want to actually like have a viable like still level potential but I, I don't know maybe it's just her play styles I guess it depends on like the elo because like I guess people will have different play styles like I'd usually say in like higher elos you'll see club mains are a lot more aggressive or like force a lot more because they're I guess they're, it's, I don't know if it's confidence or if it's just like they know the limitations more but I guess like it depends because some people are a lot more hesitant so I guess maybe it gives you a safety net but uh, it's kind of hard to say I guess but that's from my experience Sunder? No, Sunder is terrible. Trust me, it's not good. Even against tanks, it's not good. The item is just not good at all. To take, it's such like a useless thing to want to take. You're investing so much gold into like stats that you can barely ever use. Like you're gonna proc it maybe once or twice in a fight, and investing 30, 200 gold into an item that you're barely gonna proc ever, is just not worth it at all. Even against tanks, it's just it's better just to go like. Um, what's it called? Armor pen or something like that if you want that. It's just not worth it to ever go divine. It's so useless. The, the item, even with how broken it is right now, you can just never proc it. Like, if Clyde had more abilities, then yes, maybe, but like, obviously, like, Clyde doesn't have low CDs, or he doesn't have, like, a ton of abilities either, and, like, you're using your abilities at the same time, right? So you're never gonna proc it more than once, usually, in a fight, maybe. Like you get lucky if you proc it twice, but it, it's just such a counterproductive item again. Hallbreaker. It's probably going to be like situational for at least Kled, but yeah, it's going to be really broken on split pushers. But on Kled, I think it's only going to be like good into like winning matchups. I don't think you can build it every game. Because you're not always going to be able to slide lane. But it'll be a situational item for sure. I don't know when you would want to get it though, like item wise. Probably like second or third item, maybe. It's kind of hard to say though. I should have just backed here. I don't know why I'm here. It's just like. Oh, I should have just wasted my E for no reason. Their jungle is bot side, so I can just do whatever. I can also. I, I should take on my mop cover. I'll do that when I back. Because I don't need it on if I'm playing on this account. I don't really care. Let me do that quick one. Free Jaxel, kind of, I guess, because like you're getting resistances. It's not as much, obviously, but it's nice to have. Just having the extra turret damage alone is disgusting, though, on that item. If you run Demolish with that item and you're in a winning lane, you can just take over the map so quickly. You just melt the shit out of the turrets. Uh, you have like a rift tail, you can literally probably get inhib turret at like 15 minutes if uh if you're ahead. The item's just gonna be like super super snowball. -y. I feel like it's gonna be super problematic for the game as well. Because yeah, split pushers are gonna have so much like impact now in the game, like Jax, Camille, Trandomir, all those champions are gonna be disgusting with the item. What is this guy doing? I feel like...
Oh, he's gone. God damn it, man. I just wasted my flash for no reason. Oh, that's really bad for me. Oh, I actually lose a lot off that, too. Yeah, that's actually really bad for me. I TP. I should have TP'd there. I thought they needed me, but... Like, they killed him, but I guess they got them anyways. I couldn't even reach the Super Con. Even if I kept running at him, I wouldn't have... Oh, I caught up. I shouldn't have flashed. After I got his flash, I should have just turned him for the Warwick and taken the assist. Sorry, bud. And you're alone, plus the extra damage to turrets and the power a big minion? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's the other item that's coming out in the war That's not next patch, that's in like two patches, that Nemesis, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Hallbreaker's next patch. I could be wrong though. I'm pretty sure Hallbreaker's next patch, and then that Nemesis item's the patch after. Today's what, Tuesday? So the patch comes out tomorrow? I think. Unless I'm wrong, maybe it's in two weeks, or next week. Pretty sure the patch is tomorrow though. I forget when the last patch was to be honest. If it was last week or two weeks ago. I think it was two weeks ago. I'm just gonna have to let this wave slow push. There's no reason for me hitting the wave like this. Wait, that stunned me? I'm dead, by the way. Oh, never mind, I'm not dead. Wait, she just wasted her ult. I should have died there. I actually griefed really hard. Thank god I had tier 2 boots. Wait, that hit me? I thought I was far enough away, though well, that's not gonna reach me. I guess it did though. I'm actually starting to do some decent damage now. My mechanics are pretty rusty on Nar though. I've like barely played him recently. But like one game of him in the past month. Here in our man, you love him. Yeah, he's pretty fun. It's unfortunate he's not that like great right now, because I like gutted him. But he's still fun to play. But yeah, he used to be so good and then I just nerfed him like five times in a row. Oh, he's kinda mediocre. Oh my god, I couldn't even get my double E off, man. I'm pinging you where he is. Yes, and you're diamond your whole life. Please stop pinging, please. Thank you. I don't need to listen to a diamond player typing the whole game. Please and thank you. <sighs> Unlucky. Whatever, I wasn't paying attention to be honest. I was autopilot, but... Oh, it's so annoying when people type that shit. I was pinging, blah, blah, blah. It's like... Yes, and you could have counter ganked that, but you're sitting AFK here this whole time instead of moving over and counter ganking it if you know he's going to be there. Why are you typing? You literally could have made that productive play if you weren't typing. You could have actually helped me and we probably could have killed them. Yes, it's my bad for dying, but at the same time, it's like you could have done stuff instead of typing the whole time. So, like, don't type, please. This is why you're stuck in this helo, because you just typed the whole game. Yeah, he's going to Clyde Ixia. Mega Nara. Yeah. Oh shit, I dropped my boomerang, I'm trolling.
I don't know what she was doing there. She like walked into me when I still had Meganar. Like what? And she made it so I could stun her on the wall. All she had to do was just wait until my Meganar runs out and she doesn't die. Like I have to back off, but she ran into me for some reason. I'm gonna greed for this play. See if she stops my back. I don't think she will. Yeah, no, we're good. But yeah, like all she had to do there was just not walk up. <laughs> Why they buff him when he became top? Wait, what? I'm so good. Don't give him more nerf, but nerfs though. They won't nerf him for a while. Like he, if anything, they'll probably buff him again soon. But like he, he's he's nowhere near the state where he's gonna get nerfed anytime soon. He's in a pretty bad state. So yeah, they won't be touching him for a while. I could have flashed maybe and killed her, but yeah, I'm not gonna use my flash. It's not worth my time. We got one. So yeah, see, at least I have my flash. Then we got the shutdown. It's worth. Cause yeah, killing the Riven there. Yes, it's nice, but like it doesn't really do anything. Just a back anyway. So I might as well just pull the flash for tempo. Cause then she can do much. And then yeah, we got the two anyways. I don't know what this guy's doing, by the way. Wait, she didn't even back. What? Okay, our jungler's just running it down, by the way. He flames our team and then he plays like that. Nice. Not his VR. Yeah, that's a good one. Big. Guys is getting rolled. Warwick's bot side, I'm fine to do whatever because they have no TP. Alright, let's play for one more wave after this. Probably not get the turret, but. Ka oh, wait, Kadri hasn't killed you. Oh my god, that's so sad. Rip. That's really unlucky, actually. I'm pushing this out, looking for the reset, and I'm gonna TP to drag. Oh my god, I missed the cannon. I can TP if they want to look. I'm not sure if they're going to though. I can just walk back to it. Okay, never mind, I guess I'm just running back to it. You've never seen it coming? Yep. Nice poke with Nar. <laughs> How behind is she? Actually, she's almost out of gore. Not actually that far behind. Oh my god, I thought I had my mini Nar pistol. Well, she's dead anyways. Never mind, she's not dead. But I don't have Mega Nar anymore. Our team waited too long to look for the play. <laughs> if they dive, I have TP. I think they're fine. Yeah, they're fine. I'd rather just play for this turret. They're winning anyways, they don't need me. Yeah, they, they, they don't need me. I'm just gonna go for this.
My god, he actually kills me. Bro, that champion is so fucking broken, actually. I should have um, walked to my Q earlier, though, but oh my god, that champion's broken. He's 1 HP and he actually kills me there. <laughs> I actually killed me at 1 HP. So stupid Eclipse Shield. Ah, uh, I hate Zed so much. Down our sweet. Yeah, that's really nice. Astronaut, yeah, I like the Astronaut as well. I actually have a lot of Nurse skins on this account. I used to never play the champion, and then a few months ago, I started playing him. And I got like three skins from him. I got some of them from Chess, and I, I bought, I think I bought Astronaut and Dino because they were both on sale when I got them. But yeah, the Nurse skins are really nice. I like all of them. He's like, probably, oh yeah, I think I have the most skin. Like, this is my champ with the most skins. I promise you went always low and low, or you had a low and low and low, low, low Yeah, that shit's always annoying for sure. Get a lot. They're just dead, I can't help them. Actually, maybe I can. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh, I think I still kill him, actually. Wow, I hit every single one. Oh, wait, that missed, though? Okay, I still got him. I played that really well. I have to just pray he doesn't get to me in time, this Warwick. Please. Alright, I'm good. Never mind, I'm not good. Are you fucking kidding me? I, I didn't have jump, so I, I was fucked regardless there because I didn't know where they were. I had to just try to get out. Ah, that's so sad. Jinx actually got me because of Warwick's trail. He pinged it. Oh, that was so close. I played that really well, though. Oh, Warwick was topside. No. If I knew Warwick was topside, I would have just dipped. I thought Warwick was going to come to me. That's why I tried to lose back because I knew he was just going to be able to outrun me. He was actually topside. That's pretty unfortunate. I could have left. It's not the best idea. I mean, I got a kill out of it. It was fun. If I hit that ult, that would have been huge. But I actually could have gone out there. I, I thought uh, Warwick was bot side. That's why I didn't run. I could have ran, though. Like, if I missed one of those Qs, I wouldn't have went for him. Because, like, there's no point at that point. But I literally hit every Q, so I knew I could catch up to him and kill him. Team doesn't have a tank? You're talking about my team? I mean, they don't have a tank either, so it doesn't even matter. And I'm going, like, kind of tanky, so it should be fine. And he likes to follow, by the way. X Notel, thank you, my mom. I hope you stream up more. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I can put it back here. Double jump. Bonk. Servant's kind of getting worked this game, just a bit. Actually, yeah, we can make him look. Can we play for, um... Believe it or not. They're all AD by the way too, so like this is actually really easy to win. If we just don't get killed. We just turn this. I need have my mega but I can't stock yet. Like I can't get my passive up yet. Bro, just hit it! Why is my guy not hitting it? Oh my, whatever. They, sh they should both die at least. Oh my god. Where is he? Whatever. All Jarvan had to do is just not walk that way and I kill him. But he let him get out of the cage. If he just walked back towards me, uh, Warwick can't get out of that cage there and I just jump and ult him. Super unfortunate. But whatever, it's fine. I'm huge, anyways. Oh, we're dying right before drag, of course. 
Of course we die right before dragon. Why wouldn't we? Oh, she's dead. This ribbon's actually running it down. <laughs> like, what is this guy doing? I mean, I can't even... I don't think we can steal this, I'm gonna be honest. Wait, this guy keeps ulting the zillion. We can't actually commit there. I want to build up some things, so I'm just gonna queue it. I kind of want to back and then see if you have a lot of gold on me. I'm mega. I'm actually in such a good spot for this. Oh my god, that was a disgusting ult by me. Bro, I just won't get on that. Holy shit. So. Baron. Yeah, we won the game. Nice, so we actually won. You kill him and then it comes back. Yeah. Hall breaker. Yeah. Hall breaker is going to be a very, very broken and useless item at the same time. On split pushers, it's going to be disgusting, and on other champions that can't like use it that well, it's going to be a useless item. Super situational, but it's going to make certain champions really broken. That's going to be such an annoying ch item to play around. Very good this fight. Yeah, this guy's been piss smurfing, you know? <laughs> He's too good. It's fine though. I could have had this one armor here, but I'm gonna be greedy. I never get this fed because my laners usually don't run it down this hard, so fuck it. Wait, no, uh, Halo Blades actually feels really good into like these lanes where like you can't look for like extended, like super extended trades, and you just want to peel yourself. Like the high mobility champions, I think Halo is probably the way to go because it allows you to peel yourself really easily. Because you just get the proc your passive and peel out. So I'm playing with Grasp. Bro, they're actually double flashing on me. What is this? How cringe is this? They double flashed on me. Just end the game. Like, what? You guy... You okay? <laughs> what? They, they just lost the game off that. What the fuck? How mad are they? <laughs> they... They literally just, like, lose the game off that. Like, what? what why are they doing that? <laughs> hey, it has been a little while in Vendex, but what the fuck? <gasps> what did I do to these players? They're so pissed. They all they sent everyone on me. Like what? <gasps> they literally just lost the game. Like how emotional are these players for this game? What the fuck? <gasps> You're really gonna send three people on me, send TPs and flash alt, use everything on me. Like what? <laughs> Report Riven. I don't want to report the whole team, honestly, after what I just saw. 